worst fears seem to be coming to pass. Congress is debating a new bill, the Superhuman Registration Act. It would require all heroes to register with the government, whether they want to or not. Which would mean the politicians get to tell us who the bad guys are. We need to make sure this thing doesn't happen. To that end, we're heading down to Washington. I've been offered a chance to testify before a congressional subcommittee. And I'm going to rally the people down there. We need to get a grassroots resistance movement going before the SRA can gain any momentum. We want you to come along in case there's any trouble. We've got a Quinjet waiting to fly us down there. Let's go. We're coming up on DC, team. But the situation has radically changed during our flight, and not for the better. The city just came under attack by an unknown terrorist force. We're going to coordinate defense efforts with S.H.I.E.L.D. Buckle up, and be ready for anything. This is S.H.I.E.L.D. Lieutenant Farrell. We've got some of the Senators prep for evac, but the zone's too hot to lift off. Eliminate the enemy forces in the area, so we can get those people out. Choppers out. You should proceed down the hill. Head them off before they can hit us again. Approaching landing zone, ETA. Incoming staff, go clock. We're in. Go down to the left, try to put it down. Hang on. Ugh! <laughs> 
ruin my vacation. And you, dumb as nail shield clones. I saw what you did to those cherry blossoms back there. You think those things grow on trees? And you, you think it makes me less of a man if I came here for the cherry blossom festival, huh? You're laughing with your eyes. I can see it. Fine. Time for a little boss battle, suckers! You're on my radar. Next time, don't bother. Now we show them! I knew I should have sprung for the health meter enlargement I saw in that email. You're probably trying to clear out these terrorists, huh? Can I join the party? Ah, eh, they'll still be here next month. I'll take things from here. Titanium Man seems to be behind all this. He just made off with some senators and took them underground. We'll cover the capital. You get down to the subway and pursue that tin-plated Russian and his pals. I'll keep you in mind. Now go! Come on! that away! The subway! When we see Titanium Man, let's try to get him to say Moose and Squirrel. If I were a supersized Russian bad guy, I'd head for some American chow. This way, to the food court. You think you're gonna get away with this on my watch? Big guy dragged Senator Lieber and the others toward Union Station. Keep going this way.
super villains, huh? Always in the last place you look. Senator Lieber from New York State, good to meet you. You've done us a great service. You heroes are okay in my book. Maybe we should put this registration business on hold. What can I say? I've always been a friend to superheroes. Well, best of luck trying to catch that maniac. Like our state motto says, Excelsior. Don't I know you from somewhere? You don't look like the voting type. Yeah, whatever. Hey guys, I'll take these pencil pushers back to the Capitol. Give me a call if you want to hang out again. Divided. Only this time you will fall. With a little help, if necessary. Did you really think it would be that easy? That's it, I know. Your democratic ideals will be your undoing once your own people come against you. Keep attacking. Don't get trusted. Cloaking field is down. Get him. These mini sentry guns will give you something new to think about. Thank you. 
And so, to answer your question, Mr. Senator, in spite of these recent events, I don't believe forcing superheroes to register with the government is the answer. This law would split the hero community right down the middle, with consequences I'm not sure any of us want to ponder. Was that really your best shot? Sneaking around doesn't become you, Steve. Maybe I'll need the practice. Maybe we all will. Don't be so melodramatic. This whole thing would affect you least of all. You're already deputized. You almost sound like you agree with them. This registration act would tear down everything we've done. Destroy a century-old tradition of... I'm trying to save it, Steve. As much of it as I can, anyway. Don't you see where this is headed? All it's going to take is one more slip-up by anyone in a cape, and we'll be lucky if registration is the worst they do. Just turn us all into criminals. Hunt us all down. No, they won't, Tony. Not in my country. Now return to our special live episode of The New Warriors, coming to you straight from Stamford, Connecticut, where the Warriors have just been spotted by their supervillain quarry. Looks like it's on. I've got Coldheart, you guys. Hey, somebody snagged Nitro. He's rabbiting. Don't worry, Speedball. I'm on it. On your feet, Nitro. And don't bother trying any of your stupid exploding tricks. Oh, baby, don't you even know? <laughs> You're playing with the big boys now. Reports now coming in from Stamford, Connecticut, indicate a massive explosion in a residential neighborhood. Just over 12 hours ago now, and preliminary casualties are said to be over 600. In Washington, rumblings on whether superhero reform should be brought to the Following table. Following last week's devastating explosion, Congress has rushed through passage of the Superhuman Registration Act, with the President expected to sign it. This is just completely insane, Hill. 
I won't do it. I'm sorry, was it not clear I was giving you an order? You're asking me to arrest people who risk their lives for this country every day. No, I'm ordering you to obey the will of the American people, Captain. Either you help us bring them in, or we'll bring you in. Weapons down, gentlemen. Or I... Drank darts, now! Keep us moving, son, if you want to stay conscious. You idiot. We were trying to save lives. Of all the people to go underground, Captain America... Now every superhero who disagrees with the act suddenly has a leader. Maybe we should hold off until... That won't be necessary, Mr. President. Registration can go forward as planned. We'll take care of Captain America. And with the passage of the Superhuman Registration Act earlier this week, superheroes around the country are being forced to choose a side. Do they register with the government to uphold the law or become part of an underground resistance movement? So far... Can you believe this is really going down? The act kicks in at midnight, but word is S.H.I.E.L.D.'s gonna be here sooner than that, taking signatures or prisoners. I want to talk to Cage about it, but he's too busy arguing with Mr. Fantastic over there. Maybe you can break into their little powwow and get some sense out of them. Understand your skepticism, Luke, but you have to believe me. I've crunched the numbers, and we absolutely can't rebel against the government on this. If we do, the consequences... Can't be any worse than burning the Constitution. You're exaggerating. This is a temporary measure. Once things settle down... I ain't buying it, Reed. And I can't believe somebody as brainy as you would. Oh, hello. Good timing. Perhaps you can talk some sense into Mr. Cage here. He and Iron Fist seem determined to get arrested. He's the one who needs a reality check. But good luck getting anywhere with that. On the eve of the Registration Act going into effect, the grim work of identifying all the Stanford victims continues. An official list of confirmed dead is not expected to be completed for weeks. Sure you can get us to Cap without leading them right to him? Got it covered. You just stick with me. But what about the rest? How can we convince... They're gonna have to make their own choice. Stark, Richards, and Songbird are obviously a lost cause. But maybe. Well, well. Speak of the devil. So you folks made up your minds yet? From what I hear, they ain't gonna give you much more time to sit on the fence. We'd like to hear what you have to say about this historic event. Our online polls will be open... I ain't no government puppet, and I assume you feel the same way. There are worse things you could do than risk jail time to do the right thing. If they're enforcing unconstitutional laws and hunting you down like a dog, hell yeah. Dr. Pym, Bacterian Nanite samples have just arrived for you from the Baxter building. And so, in a worst-case scenario, we'd find ourselves in the equivalent of a super-powered civil war. Heroes so busy fighting each other, the criminals get a free pass. Exactly. That's where you and the Thunderbolts would come in, Melissa. We need you to help S.H.I.E.L.D. keep crime under control while we focus on... Oh, hello again. I'm glad to see you're not going off half-cocked like Luke, Danny, and Eli over there seem to be. We need cooler heads to prevail at a time like this. I'm not sure that's been determined. Incarceration, most likely. Those who violently resist might accidentally be harmed. 
Security, prepare to receive inbound shield contingent. I'm not in charge of that, of course, but that's what I'm hearing. Not a pleasant thought. My pleasure. Superhumans, the Registration Act is in effect. You are now required to meet with Commander Hill and register your identity with S.H.I.E.L.D. Though the incident was eclipsed by Stanford, many advocates point toward the Washington, D.C. attack as evidence that superheroes are absolutely necessary in today's world. I'm glad to see you're willing to meet with me on civil terms. Once you register, I'm sure we'll have a productive relationship. The paperwork is right here. Step up and sign, please. With Stark tech and shield muscle backing you up, count on it. So, what's it gonna be, heroes? Just sign up here and you'll be bona fide law enforcement agents. You're not looking to start trouble, are you? I stand ready. Smart move. I'm glad to see you're going through with registration. Congratulations on making the right choice, heroes. The only one you really had. I'll look forward to working with you. No! How could you?! Cage told me I should have left with him and Iron Fist, but I didn't believe you'd do this! You damn traitors! Well, looks like your first assignment just walked through the door. Either convince that idiot to register, or take him down. Shut up! There's nothing you can say to make me join you! This is for Cap! An unfortunate introduction to government service for you. I'm sorry it had to come to that. Cage and Iron Fist refused to sign and escaped, and they're apparently not alone. I'm just glad you made the correct decision. Let's head back into the main area. We're gonna have our hands full, I expect, and I'm sure Tony will want to thank you personally once he gets back from Washington. I don't need to tell you that you've made the right choice. You're here. And that means you understand the reality of our situation. You know what we're up against. Who we're up against. We simply can't restore the public's faith in us, while Captain America and his recruits are still playing by the old rules. S.H.I.E.L.D. is going to use their expanded authority to keep supervillain activity in check. That leaves us with responsibility for dealing with the rogue heroes. We need to act decisively to end this fast. We have a few leads, and may be close to identifying one or more locations being used as hideouts by the Rebels. Come back here later. By then, we should have something more solid. Yeah, I'm, thinking of transferring to CIA. 
I hate that it's come to this, but we have a job to do. We'll reconvene at the briefing station when you're ready. At least one superhero has refused to take a side in the registration controversy.